forest firefighters battle blazes in forests and rangelands. These fires can grow to the size of a small country, threatening wildlife as well as homes and businesses in their path. As soon as flames are spotted, forest firefighting crews mobilize. They drive or fly to the fire scene with hand tools, chainsaws, pumps and hoses, and heavy earth-moving machinery. A basic principle in fighting forest fires is to create a gap or fire break to stop the spread of the flames. Another technique is to fight fire with fire using a method called backlighting. Small fires are strategically set to burn away the fire's fuel and stop it in its tracks. In deep wilderness, firefighters can't always drive in with bulldozers and other equipment. To reach these inaccessible areas, elite firefighters, called smoke jumpers, parachute from airplanes. Despite the extreme hazards of the job, competition to become a smoke jumper is especially fierce. Most forest firefighters are employed by the government and openings can be dictated by available funding. A high school education may be required. Applicants need to pass written and physical tests. Like their city and suburban counterparts, forest firefighters must be able to push themselves to the absolute maximum. The danger is extreme. An unexpected shift in the wind can change the direction of a forest fire, leaving few, if any, escape routes. This is a career that demands physical fitness, the ability to work as part of a team, and tremendous courage. Firefighters must be willing to travel to distant fires. Often it is the bravery, dedication, and sacrifice of these men and women that save wildlife and people from tremendous destruction.